What's up, guys? It's Waffles. Today I got a battle against uh, Cory4646 um, from the AX chat. Uh, this is a 4th gen NU battle, and I haven't been doing 4th gen for a long time, so I decided to get back into it. Um, this is probably going to be the last battle for the week, and for the upcoming two weeks, I believe, because my exams are starting next week, and I'm going to be, I want to uh, go prepare. Um, so yeah, he's using sort of a lols team, and this is sort of just a filler battle, because I don't want to leave you guys empty for two weeks. Uh, so, um, yeah, it wasn't a great battle. Uh, we actually had a battle after this. Uh, it was actually a really good battle, but, um, it, uh, <clears throat> didn't go out too well because there was a DC at the end, so that was a pretty, sh that was a big shame. So, yeah, as you can see, he's using a lols team, it's NU, and he has a Rattata. And I'm not even kidding, this Rattata actually caused more damage to my team than other of his pokes did. So, um, you just basically saw what happened if you were paying attention and stuff. So I'm going to switch out into Vigoroth, so you can, I can take whatever I can throw at me. He goes for the facade, and look how much this does. It does, like, a lot of damage. So, that was pretty surprising, I suppose. Um, so yeah, um, I love that. Uh, pretty, uh, not as good as thought, and I get killed by Circle Punch, so basically I just got owned by Rattata. That is embarrassing. Yeah. So I'm gonna bring in Nido Queen. He's gonna miss his Zen Headbutt. Um, to be honest, that probably mattered a little bit. Um, actually it didn't matter all that much because another of his, one of his posts killed me anyways. So he's gonna go for the Facade, and it's gonna hit, uh, and do quite a bit of damage. See, if you miss, if you hit a Zen head, but I would be down pretty low, but it didn't make a difference because it's Q-Bone, but it killed me anyways with, um, a Boomerang, which he actually does right now, which is kind of weird. I'm getting owned by a bunch of NFEs, so yeah, it's kind of a lols battle. Actually, it was a lols team on his part. Um, so it's looking pretty bad for me. I already lost two of my tanks slash walls. And yeah, I'm gonna bring in a revenge killer, um, Gardevoir. I'm gonna go for the psychic, and that's gonna take him out. So that's good. Um, he's gonna go to his Rattata, and I'm predicting the Sucker Punch because that's what they do and stuff. And I'm gonna switch out and go into my Hot Sauce, which ends up doing really good in this battle. And if you remember my Hot Sauce, it's my uh, Howl Typhlosion. So yeah. I'm gonna go for the quick attack. He goes for the sucker punch and fails. So that was pretty good move. On, pretty good move on my part. So um, yeah, he's gonna go into his Gligar. And he forgets that he's. Um, I'm gonna switch out. Go into my Mr. Mime. He forgets that he's scarfed and he goes for a substitute, which is kind of a stupid play. And um, yeah, so he's gonna set up a. Uh, he's gonna switch out. Go into his Mothum. I'm gonna go into. Um, yeah, he takes stealth rock damage. I'm gonna go into my Typhlosion because. Um, I can set up on that thing, I suppose. He's gonna, I'm gonna set up a Howl, he's gonna go for the Air Slash, which takes me pretty low. But, um, I suppose that's fine, and I'm just gonna kill it off with the Flare Blitz here, which I probably should have done in the first place, but, um, I didn't really think it mattered, because I have plus one now, I'm ready to sweep. So, um, Recoil takes me on to 66, but I don't have the Life Orb, I have the Leftovers, so that's pretty good. I can heal up constantly every single turn. So he's going to bring in his Torkoal, and I know that can probably take whatever I can throw at him, but um, he actually doesn't carry any other move aside from the Lava Plume. Um, so that Lava Plume is not going to be doing anything to me. I'm going to live that and uh, recover from leftovers. And at the second Earthquake, I will be killing off the Torkoal. So basically, um, I'm... I'm pretty much just going to sweep his rest of his team here because he has an Articuno and some other post that you'll see eventually. Um, this wasn't a good battle, as I said. Um, we had a really close battle last time, uh, but uh, there was a DC in the end, which really sucked. Um, and, uh, yeah. Um, I just want to say right here, uh, this guy isn't as bad as he looks. He's just, as you can see, you can tell from his pokes, he's quite an original battler. And, uh... It's actually one of the few p uh, qualities I actually respect on. But um, my Typhlosion is just going to sweep here. Um, I don't think there's a Howl set on Smogan yet, so no one really predicts it. 
which is nice because in the last battle I kind of um, almost swept someone else as well, but then there was a DC in the end as well. Keep getting disconnections. I should probably AFK more, but um, yeah. Um, so that's good game, Corey four six four six. Um, I really hope to have a rematch with you, and that's some, uh, yeah. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, check out his channel. We'll be in the sidebar, and um, yeah, no videos for the next two weeks, and that's about it. So uh, see you guys later. Peace.